Hi guys, welcome to my new video. Today we are going to get my face waxed and for getting my face waxed I'll be using Rika Brazilian Wax which is particularly formulated for sensitive areas like your face, your bikini area or your underarms. So this particular wax is popularly known as paraffin wax so when you apply it, it hardens. There's no need of using uh, waxing strips to rip out the wax your hair of that particular area so it is completely different from your hot wax hot wax you apply you put the strip and you rip it off like I said so without any further ado let's get into the video I'm just fumbling thank you before we understand what hot wax and a hard wax is here is a difference my finger just sinked in into the hot wax and hard wax so it's that hard can of hard wax ready to open this is the external packaging of the Brazilian hard wax it's a no strip wax I do have a wax heater but to melt the hard wax and to make things easy and faster I melt the hard wax on my gas stove and then to maintain the heat I use my wax heater wax is almost melted I'm going to keep my wax heater side by side so that once I'm done heating the wax on the stove I can directly pop the can in the wax heater Bear in mind not to hold the can single handedly, use both your hands or else you are likely to have an accident. To maintain the melted consistency of the wax, once your wax is popped into the wax heater, Set the temperature according to what consistency you want your wax to be. One quick suggestion here, don't use reusable spatulas for your waxing session with hard wax. It is recommended that you purchase disposable waxing spatulas that are easily available online on Amazon or at your local beauty supply store. We are going to start off with dipping my wooden spatula, the disposable spatula and get into the waxing session. We are going to start off by prepping my face. I am going to apply baby powder so that all the excess oil is absorbed and my wax applies easily. A quick story time here. I have had facial hair for a long time. And many girls do have facial hair there's nothing to be ashamed of but I dealt with facial hair wrongly I would use depilatory creams which are those kind of creams where you apply on the hairy area wait for five to ten minutes take a damp cloth and rinse that area What depilatory creams do is they just take the hairy layer from the top they don't destroy your roots so waxing is a very good method 
of getting rid of the hair and facial hair is best removed with hard wax not with your regular hot wax it doesn't it is not as effective please note to secure your head hairs in a bun otherwise you will unnecessarily apply hard wax on your head hairs and nobody wants that you could even choose shaving from waxing if you find waxing really painful there are a couple of shaving razors available online that is specifically made for women's facial hair of preference and personal choice you may not be harsh with yourself or hard on yourself because you have facial hair it is absolutely normal a quick note here in case you plan on opting for hard wax for hair removal a thick layer of hard wax needs to be applied on the particular area so you can grip on the end of it and quickly pull off the hard wax The other method for hair removal is epilation. Epilation is a method that I have tried and it is painful but effective. So all the methods that I have mentioned in this video are tried and tested. An epilator is a device that has small tweezers and which rotate. Each time it rotates, it pulls out the hair. and you can literally feel each hair pulling out once the waxing is complete i take some oil on my palm you can use avocado oil olive oil or coconut oil rub it on my palms and generously apply on the area where i have waxed this method is to let loose any excess wax that is remaining on my face waxing caused redness on my face to settle that down i am going to apply ice all over okay you guys that's all for today like share comment below and please subscribe to my channel